Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys a few different PowerPoint views that are available for you guys and different advantages that each one of them may possess. So, by default, the normal view, which is what you currently are seeing here, that's what most people actually work in. But there's actually benefits to moving between the different view settings. So, without further ado, let's jump right into some of them. So we're going to start by left clicking on the view tab up at the top one time and you're going to notice quite a few different presentation views off on the left side here. So one of the first ones on here that we can see says outline view. So if I actually left click on it, it will basically just present them in a slide format that will show the outline form. So each slide will come up on the left side here and just it will be an outline as the name entails and just will have them all out in an order on the left side as to what order the slides are in, what the title header might show as well. And if we went over to the slide sorter, we'll click on that. It's going to show you what your slides look like within a thumbnail format. So it could definitely make it easier to sort and organize different sequences of slides as you work through your presentation. You also have the note page as well. So again, this was kind of try and fit it onto a Word document kind of format here and it'll show you if you have different notes underneath so your slide would be up top and any comments you had underneath would be shown here and if we moved over to reading view so if you were going to hook this up to some external display source and you were going to maybe project it onto a different display or a screen this would probably be a good view for you guys so it'll occupy the entire computer screen and you would see the presentation the same with the audience would as well and you can basically see how graphics, images, moving objects such as animated effects how they would roll across the screen as you went through the slides so depending on how elaborate your PowerPoint presentation is it could definitely be interesting so I'm just going to left click on the little reader icon on the bottom right to get out of that mode so I'm going to left click on the little slideshow button on the bottom right to get us in the slideshow mode and again this would be exactly like the same thing that I just went through before and if you hit escape key you'll get out of that so so I go back over to normal view so just wanted to give you guys a basic idea of some of the features in that so I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out and as always thank you for watching and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye